Today I'm going to be going out and uh, climbing a tree known as the Spring Lady. It was just found last weekend by some friends of mine out here and it's one of the most prettiest trees I've seen. So getting to it today and I'm going to do a little solo climb and bring you along in one of my most special places. Spring Lady is surrounded with what I call quick mud and this stuff is bad. I don't like being in it because it it looks kind of solid but you you never really know when you're gonna go in all the way up to your this is the the shot that I'm gonna have to make up to the tree I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to try to thread the needle through these palmetto fronds to get up to the uh, the branches that I'm gonna want to set a line on they're not that high they're only about 50 feet up but but it's still hard to find a place to stand out here much less shoot a line from so um, luckily I'll be having the advantage of a shoulder fired slingshot with me today that uses a trigger release mechanism invented by Ron Reese and uh, using that I'll be able to point straight up through the palmettos and probably get this thing hopefully on the first shot but we'll see Well, I'm in the in the top of Spring Lady now, and uh, what can I say? I'm having probably one of the best days I'm gonna have all year. I'm out here in a swamp by myself. I'm in a huge ancient cypress tree, and uh, there's nothing but the song of the birds around me. So this is this is about as good as it gets for me. Got about two more pitches. And uh, then I'm going to see if I can wiggle myself down inside this tree. Well, what I'm planning to do is set a pitch up there. I don't know if you can see. I got my string over a good branch up there. And I'm going to try to, once I get my rope set up there, climb up a bit, strip down my saddle, and then see if I can wiggle into this hole right here. And uh, if I can, if I can get in there, there is a there's a false bottom up here in the top of the tree inside of it. And I'm going to see if I can get down down into this cavity inside the tree. Well, I just, uh, I don't think I'm going to fit into this hole today. <laughs> and I'm trying to squeeze into it, but it's, it's pretty tight. And I'm, I'm thinking to myself, I kind of hear Jim K in the background saying, reason not to climb, Obi. That's a pretty good reason not to climb. So I'm going to, I'm going to get myself back out of this thing. And, uh, well, I'm just going to sit up here and enjoy myself. Just take it easy and enjoy the first days of spring.
Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna climb on that. I'm going to see if I can show everybody one of the main reasons I don't think I'll be coming back to this tree very often. This is just one of those spots that you step in and it just keeps on going. It takes your whole leg down and the suction of it, if you get in there, you could be stuck for real. So, I don't know, this is a, Spring Lady is an awesome tree, huge base, big enough to crawl inside and get three or four or five people inside of the tree but uh, it's just a soupy mess all around it still one of my favorite places to be just not one of my favorite places to get stuck